So I'm gonna I'm gonna do a video because I'm gonna be the first one to do this video. Nobody knows this. If, if Tesla doesn't know how to do it, okay. You ready? Yep. Okay. So these are the new wheel covers. As you see, they're a little bit shorter. The spokes of them. Um, these are the new wheel covers. These are the new redesigned wheel right. covers for Cybertruck. And we're gonna go over how you're supposed to we're properly go over correct installation. So this is actually a two-piece unit. What you're supposed to do is ma manually pull it apart. I know this seems like you might break something, but I promise you won't. So you just, just like pull that. it out. You okay. pull it apart, just like that. So the okay. correct way to install it is you put, you put the first part in, just like that. Are you li you're not lining this up with anything? Nothing's being lined up on this part. Okay. The part that has to be lined up is this. So then you align this to the wheel. To, to, the, to this. To, on to your actually, you see that you can, it has a, a road map. Okay, basically. so you to right here. Right there. Yep. They all match. And then you, oh, sorry. You gotta get one, you gotta get one in. There we go. And we'll do it right now. Okay, clicked. So once you get one in, you align it perfectly, and then you just start popping them in. Oops. Of course, it doesn't work on video. That's how it goes. It is exactly, oh, there it goes. And if you see, there's still a little bit off. You can, this is not the video we're gonna use. <laughs> oh, we're using this one. I did it wrong. Oh, I didn't do it wrong. I just, So of... let's say you do it wrong. You just rip it off, it, it brings you the whole thing. You gotta do it all over again. Okay, keep going. You see what I'm doing? This though? is what happens when you make a video. Yeah. It becomes a whole different world. So that's how not to do it. Yeah, of course. Okay. Here's why I had the issue. <laughs> is because I did it right. Of course, I did it in line with all the other ones. You see this? Okay. So what you're really supposed to do. Gosh. Get it right, Drake. I'm like, I'll pick this one later in the video. Okay, so this is how you do it the right way. Yeah, we're gonna do it the right way. This would have gone perfectly on my truck. Yeah. It's because yeah, it's yeah. this old version okay. of the truck. So we'll do it again now. Uh-huh. Just pull it right off. It should be super easy. So separate this. You just pull it separate. By the way, I'm not editing anything. Woo, this is all going sweating. in. Okay. So then you take this, mm -hmm. you put it on the truck. Yeah. Unlike the original mounts went around these spokes. Okay. Which created s scratches in the wheels that I got on my original. Okay. Now, if you notice, oh, this actually going goes here. in between. So uh -huh. it's actually putting pressure on the back of it. Yeah, so you're going in between the spokes. Correct. Oh, I see. I see. Okay, that's okay. what you did wrong. Okay. Well, no, no, that's not what I did wrong. Oh, you did that right? No, I did okay. that right. Okay, now, what did you now, do wrong here? It's just making sure that you're not pushing into exactly the same spot as you're not pushing what this you're not pushing these yes okay directly into the same spot as there we go there we go so you don't want that to be where the clips were from inside the inside exactly. piece now we're doing it okay There we go. There we go. That's a correct wheel cover. So, and this is incorrect. So that's correct. So this is all supposed to just line up. Yeah, you okay. can tell if you did it right by it lining up right there. Okay. It's a little bit, you know. <laughs> so yeah, I would have to see on another one what you're supposed to make sure you don't put in the same place. See, well, you don't, so you have two parts. This is the part that bites into the actual wheel. Right. And then if you notice right there, 
is the part that connects the actual cover. Okay, and that's connected to the cover. Correct. Okay, so you don't want them going in the same place? The reason is this right here will bend a little more than this rigid uh, part will. So you, you want me? that thing underneath off center from this? Correct. Okay. Exactly. Okay. Exactly. All right. Hopefully that gives the you real, The real Drizzy on X for anyone who wants to harass him and get more info. Yeah. Out. But yeah, if you want to get your Cybertruck back to the original look, I guess the new hubcaps are out now. Are you gonna do that? What? You gonna do it on the other side? Oh yeah, but you don't gotta film another one. Okay. Make me look like a fool. There we go. You got what you got. There you go. <laughs> oh, oh no, we're gonna do a bonus. Keep yeah. going for it. All right. I like it. You're sweating. You're working. I'm not sweating, by the way. You, a, you don't have wheel covers. <laughs> All right. So just go through it. Don't explain it this time. Yes, sir. So you just want this, these to be off center from the clips that are here. Correct. So yes. you don't want this to go in at the same place Correct. as that. Correct, yeah, okay. yeah. And that may have to do with the way your tire is on your rim. So you might just get in a position where that's the only choice you have, but that your goal is to not do that. Right, let's close the door and then look at it. There you go. All right. That's what a cyber is supposed to This is how it's supposed to look. All right, guys, there you go. I'm out. Peace. There's no guarantee that you may or may not, I'm not flipping you off, you may cut your fingers the first time you do this. But what's nothing, what's the term you use? A flesh wound, nothing but a flesh wound, yeah. anything for cyber. Battle scars. Yeah, battle scars.